it guys, fire our shit! Well howdy folks and welcome back to the garage. First things first, I am so sick that I can barely speak, my voice is really messed up, so you get to listen to this computer voice named Daniel. Today, I am comparing the newly minted 59 pattern to the original type 59. Is the 59 pattern a better type 59? Let's dig in. Looking strictly at the numbers presented in game I would give the edge to type 59. But 59 pattern does have some strong attributes like the gun having slightly better DPM at 2198 versus 2010 hit points due to its extra 2.59 rounds per minute firing rate. Better dispersion at 0.321 versus 0.358. Better aim time at 4.2 versus 4.9 seconds and excellent gun depression at minus 10 degrees. 59 pattern also trumps type 59 with 100 more hit points at 1400. As well the spicy heat ammo has excellent penetration at 268 millimeters. There is one other specification listed in game that the 59 pattern smashes the type 59. And that is rear halama. Type 59 has 45 millimeters. And in game the 59 pattern rear halama is listed as 100 millimeters. If we check armor inspector we see that it is listed as 45 millimeters. The same as type 59. Which makes way more sense than 100 millimeters. I am wondering if this spec is a typo. In all other specs, type 59 either matches up or excels. And mostly it excels. Despite Type 59's turret having better specs, frontly they are both intimidating. Where the 59 pattern turret fails horribly is the horrible pimple of a machine gun turret on top. And when we look at it here in Armor Inspector we can see that it is indeed a massive weak spot. So were you in the Type 59 you can face at your enemies to help guard your relatively weak hull. But the 59 pattern will not be effective using that tactic. This pimple turret also reduces the effectiveness of your excellent 10 degrees of gun depression as this turret will appear over the ridgeline long before your gun can shoot anyone. You will have to rely on peekaboo timing to poke over after your opponent has fired. Being a premium tank. How is the credit earning? Type 59's credit earning coefficient is very good at 180 times, according to Blitz Stars. And while I don't have this info available for 59 pattern, my analysis of many battles in each tank suggests the 59 pattern is also a good credit earner. Let's talk about how you get this tank as well. You need to buy crates in the store. I bought 15 crates for 24,000 gold and luckily got the tank on the 15th crate. I know people already who have opened 60 crates before they got it. That's 96,000 gold. How much does that cost in your local currency? It's far too much isn't it? While the 59 pattern is not a bad tank, I feel that you would be far better off actually paying for the type 59 when it comes available in the store over purchasing the lottery crates for the 59 pattern. 59 pattern's gun is better than type 59's, as is the gun depression. But almost every other spec is inferior to the Type 59. But the final straw for myself is the pimple of a machine gun turret on top of the main turret. This weak spot is very easy for your opponents to hit. And it seriously reduces the worth of your excellent gun depression and well armored turret front. Well folks, there you have it. If you enjoyed this video, please leave a like down below. If you really enjoyed this video, hit the subscribe button. Let me know in the comments. As well, be sure to visit my social media pages, both on Facebook and Twitter. This is where I post info that, well, not belonging in a video, it's worth taking a look at. Now, a lot of you have been very generous with donations, becoming patrons, or donating during the live streams, or sending in your replays so I can commentate and put them up for others to enjoy. But it's also very helpful just watching the vids, liking and subscribing, so I just wanted to make sure that those of you who support in that manner know that I really appreciate what you're doing as well. Thank you. Links to all things in the video description. Alright folks, thanks very much for stopping by and watching. I'll catch you next time.